Hello there, my name is Verify and welcome to Banished Mega Mod 9. Yes, we're going to do a series on it and why not? I've decided to go with an Adam and Eve start. Yes, I guess you could say this is a very slow way of starting, but don't worry, I have the editing tools on standby. So I'm going to try and cram as much as I can into say a 20 to 30 minute uh, video for you so you get to see as much as possible. At least that's the plan. Anyway, what's the point in talking? I think I should just get straight on with it. So. We have uh, two people here, a man and a woman. What are their names? And will I remember them? Here is, here is the ultimate question. Is 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 Amari? Oh God, butchered is Amari and Darren. So why can't these be easier names? I mean, I don't even know. Anyway, the town is Angel's View. So, I guess the premise is these two people are shipwrecked. They they've come in. Um, I don't know how they've managed to get their boat that far down the river. Let's not ask that question. What do we need? We need some of the basics. So we're gonna need a roof over our head. Now I guess I could go with a tent or something like that, but I'm probably just gonna go with a bog standard wooden house. I mean, why not? Let's let's stick with some of the uh, vanilla assets wherever we can, because I think that's sort of nice if you ask me. So let's um let's mark some trees. Let's also mark some stone. Which means we're going to need somewhere to drop all this stuff, right? This will probably do the job nicely. So for those of you that don't know me, I don't necessarily play Banished in the most challenging of ways. My sort of uh, idea of playing the game is more of a decorative sort of way. Uh, that's just the way I prefer it. Um, it's, it's just, I don't know, it's just different. I prefer it. We're also going to need uh, firewood, which will be under one of these things here. You are fuel production, and I want something small here because... I haven't got a lot of resources, so I'm thinking there is, I think it's like a chopper or something, mini woodcutter. That'll probably do the job, to be fair. Ten, ten wood, perfect. And what I might do is just sort of uh, keep this looking a little bit sort of realistic, I suppose, from the get-go is. You probably have the, the chopper right next door to your house. Why not? I mean, you're going to chop the wood and you're going to go... Oh, pretty stuff just happened. I'm sorry, easily distracted. Uh, let me close this map. Oh, oh, nice. This is what I like to see. Uh, this is one of the things I like about the custom um, sort of map styles. It, it is it is much prettier. Okay, uh, next thing, because I'm just talking so much. We do need food. So, hmm. I don't think I'm going to set a gatherer's hut, or should I? Do you know what? I'm going to. Because I can just tell them to go and gather the resources. But, um, do you know what? I might stick this the other side of the house, actually. Let's think about this. So I'm going to build a lot there. So, actually, I'm going to put it more, say, here. And we'll run a path to that eventually. So, we've got firewood. We've got a source of food. We have a home. Health is going to be an issue. Tools is going to be an issue. Uh, how are we doing for tools? Five. So, we're definitely going to need that. And as it's only Adam and Eve... Now... I guess you could say, don't worry, they're going to have children. But children take time to grow up. So, we need some kind of way of getting nomads in. Here we go. Sign for nomads. 100% of population. So, I have two people. So, that means, technically, I should get two people. Let's go for 50%. We'll put it here. Another ship. We have our first house in Angel's View. And, oh, there he goes. I'm going to say he because I forgot his name already. And they're both carrying the only food they have currently to the house. Which is apples. Which, I guess, is not <laughs> a really uh, nourishing sort of food. I mean, it's nice. Everyone enjoys an apple, right? Um, we have marked some uh, wild food for collection. But we're probably going to need a few more trees. Let's go for the ones over here. Because if we're going to start making firewood... Oh, dear. Okay, so I've obviously gone around and put a few key buildings in. We have our house here, as you can see. Lovely. We have our mini woodcutter, which we're not using currently. A herbalist is still waiting to be built. We have a mini gatherer here. And we have this lovely uh, hunter's tree. The reason I chose that, apart from it not using a lot of resources, it has a huge area of effect. And we also have the ability to fish, which is absolutely fantastic. So we have a few choices there. Uh, we do need to work on clothes, and we do need to work on tools. Now, clothes... Hmm, I'm probably going to be limited to, to leather, so that's where the, the, the hunter's going to come in here. The next thing I think we'll work on is the uh, tool production. So, unless I'm wrong in thinking, because this is, where is it? Have we got any iron? We have. So, that right there is uh, iron ore. So, we need to process that as well, right? So, we will uh, collect almost all. Which one of these? Iron ore. Yeah, well, we'll go for this one. A little bit further away. So, that will do nicely. So, we'll get that uh, in preparation. 
Um, just let me double check. Okay. All resources have been moved around. So let's pause the game a second. We will take one builder away. And just let me quickly check the food. We have some fodder. And I don't even know what fodder's for. Can we, please let me know down in the comments. That'd be uh, really, really useful. And uh, also, while you're down there typing, you imbecile, you don't know what you're doing in this game. Why make a video? <laughs> uh, please uh, give the video a like, just so I know that you uh, you would like to see more, basically. Because now I'm back. I just uh, I just want to make more and more videos. Oh, we have a child. Hello there, sir. It did look like a boy. It is. Z -z 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 yeah, okay. Um, I'll just call you X. Sound like Elon Musk's child. Lovely. Do we need fuel production? Now, that's a question. Charcoal. Possibly. What have we got here? Small fit there. That's a little bit too much. For you. Old Smith. Oh, no. You're too big. Yeah, <laughs> boy. Yes, yes. There's going to be plenty of innuendos. I do love an innuendo. I mean, who doesn't? You know what? I've gone for a slightly uh, bigger uh, smithy. We, we've gone for, I think it was this one. Because it has a similar sort of look and style to this. So I think, yeah, we'll go for that. Uh, we do need to process some um, wood into charcoal. Is there something of a reasonable size? Oh, snow. I've not seen snow in this game for so long. Which small fuel refinery? That's a little bit too big. Um, fuel refinery. I'm sure there's a charcoal burner. But while I think about that, where are we for firewood? Because I don't want these people freezing to death. We have 50, which is not enough. So the next thing to do, I guess, is to switch my laborer to a builder and turn some of this lovely wood into firewood. Why not? So let's just do a quick check in to see where we're up to. Okay, so we have a little bit of food here, some wild seeds, mushroom. Okay, again, I don't know what the fodder is, but we have we have a few bits and pieces here. Not a great deal, but what have they got in the house? Apples, uh, oats, onions, okay. I did assign uh, someone over here to be... Aha, there we are, we have some fish. So that's nice, so we have another option there. And we've also placed down the old smith and the charcoal burner. So we need to get these built, but we are lacking a little bit of stone here. I think we have nine. That's probably enough for this. So what I may do here is quickly switch the fisher off and hopefully someone will haul that. There we go. Perfect. So we've, we've definitely got enough food to get us through winter. I think there's only the three people here. Um, once we get a few more people in, obviously we'll we'll think more about farms and things like that. Um, but for the for the time now... Uh, I think we're quite good. I mean, if anyone has actually done Admin Eve, and I know quite a few people do usually use uh, this method of playing the game, please feel free to uh, give me any hints and tips. Just bear in mind, I am going to be using all the things in Mega Mod. Um, there's going to be some buildings you could maybe consider a little bit cheaty in the way that they work, and obviously some potential would make it a bit harder. But in the long run, I'm going for the aesthetic look of my town and not the challenge. Um, I just sort of like this idea of starting with just a couple of people here. I wish I could do something with this child. I mean, I don't I don't mean put him to work, obviously. I just mean I wish I could, you know, let him start learning. But I don't believe... In fact, let me have a look. It's probably going to be under one of no, the houses. Where's the education thing? We have worship. Hmm. Maybe that's something to put in, right? Is it, doesn't that deal with some form of happiness? But it'd be nice if there was a school that you could go up, go to by yourself and just read, like a library, for example. I don't know if that is a thing. This is this is where I get slightly distracted now. I'm going to see something. Uh -huh. We'll use that one because that one looks just perfect. There we are. We'll put you in as well. But we currently have no builders, but we're now in early spring, which can only mean one thing. It's almost time for the nomads. <laughs> And also the fact there's plenty of food um, should we need to stock up. My goodness, they did actually eat through quite a lot of that stuff. But there's plenty of things here for now. Um, tools is, is my sort of concern. But let the laborers do their work. What do we have? We have 13 stone. So that needs stone. And we have 28 logs. We have plenty. They're here. They're here. <laughs> right. Are they going to be at the flag? Uh, no. Where are they? Oh, wait a minute. It's telling me they're here. But I don't see them. Aha. Uh -huh. That's a little bit. Okay, so we have two, which means we need another house. Let's allow them. Um, at the moment, it's not sort of telling me they're homeless. Ah, because I had the game paused. Right. Let's see. Where are you? You are literally at the edge of a map somewhere. This is wonderful. 
Mm, bring up the map. Let's have, let's bring up the large one. Where are we currently? Oh my goodness. Wait, they they're here, and we are here. That means there's two rivers they need to cross. That mm, 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 that means they can't. Oh my god, they can't get to us. <laughs> Wait a minute. If I build a small bridge here, yes. Yes, that is the answer. He says a small bridge. That is quite a big uh, river here. How are we going to do this? Because we don't have the materials. Uh, the first thing I think I'm going to do is... Where are the bridges? What do we have? Stone. Or oh, a rock bridge. Perfect. That is going to need 19 stone. Yeah, that's just a small amount there, isn't it? But I, I don't think that's a problem. Right, storage. Let's whack in a stone stockpile. In fact, if we put it in on, on top of the stone, is that the smart thing to do? Let's see if, um, let's see where they go, because I'm sort of curious. I'm hoping that because they're over here, that they are going to go straight across to wherever I just put that stockpile. It is here and start working on that, which then if I make one of them a builder, at least, um, they should hopefully <laughs> he says uh, build the bridge and then take the long walk all the way up here we need to put in another house so do we put them straight across or do we um i don't think they should have a larger house or do we put them somewhere else i think you know we'll, we'll have them as neighbors why not let's drop them right there perfect that's not the priority this is going to be so if we hit the old uh, priority there we go boom thank you very much and we'll see what these people are doing here okay they're already working on the stone i love their happiness and health is like all the way up there <laughs> i do i do wonder how we're feeling oh no you're you're good okay okay your health is a little bit lower um why you go are you actually going down there to help you are currently working and you have your bringing stone oh my goodness what's a champion didn't need to do it but realized that that their new neighbors are in a little bit of like stress there thinking, hey, do you know what? I'll, I'll bring some stone we only need 19 but they just can't they just well, oh my god everybody's helping see this is a real community <laughs> this is what i'm talking about where everyone does their bit before everyone dies okay so we have some stones so if i make somebody a builder please be one of these people you are a laborer oh do i just make everybody a builder that's the smart thing right I can't find I can't find a thing. Let's um Priority. It's here somewhere. There it is. Surely you're gonna pick up some of this stuff. You're a builder and you're doing nothing. Ah, you're not educated. That says it all. And you're not doing anything either. So we, we we've just assigned. Hmm. Okay, what happens if I switch to one builder? Let's let's test the theory. Somebody's gotta do it, right? You're a labourer. And you're a labourer. Okay. That's just perfect absolutely perfect and you know what really sort of gripes me there a little bit when i think about it we have stone oh wait a minute you've not finished why have you not finished doing that hello well i, I mean do i have to make that a priority is that the thing i'm a little bit confused there okay now now we have now we're starving now that is an issue we're gonna kill we're gonna kill two people in the first video <laughs> oh my goodness that's not the way I wanted it to go. Oh dear, it happened. We ki <laughs> we killed <laughs> we killed the first two people that were supposed to join. Oh my goodness! I think we may just glaze over that one and pretend it never happened. I mean, I, you didn't see it. I I certainly didn't see anything. We'll just we'll just move across here like so. And uh, well, I think it'd be a really good idea to build a bridge here. So we'll put a little stone stockpile because we're obviously going to build a. Uh, stone bridge right that that makes sense just just in case we need to cross the river at some point for no specific reason and um yeah that just it seems like a fantastic idea uh, where were we anyway uh, can we have a charcoal builder almost done uh we need a few more logs uh hold to the old smith we can we can pause this this building for now we don't need an extra house just yet yeah the, uh, the, the the sun hasn't grown up <laughs> <laughs> and decided to move out oh boy i can't believe i messed that up <laughs> anyway oh dear winter is here and that is certainly not something i want to see cold and hungry oh <laughs> oh no that's not good at all 
we're now down to one person. Yeah, you see, that's most definitely my fault. <laughs> oh, this is the best start to a banished uh, Let's Play series that I've ever had. And the problem is, is they were walking too far to do this. I think that is uh, most likely uh, the problem there. So let's get rid of that. Um, that may or may not teach me a lesson. I don't know. You tell me. Um, I don't often learn anything quickly. Um, it was the uh, it was the lady of the family as well, which means that there's no chance of an extra child. So we are literally depending on why why are you why are you hungry? Oh my goodness! We have food though. Do we not have food? We don't have food. Oh crap. So we've um, successfully managed to kill everybody. And look, we have a nomad actually, or two nomads actually by where they should be. And um, yes, so wonderful. So we literally lost everybody because they decided to spawn down there. And then we tried to obviously rescue them. And guess what? We killed everybody. Wonderful. But now, thankfully, we, <laughs> we have two people. Um, that have come to rescue our our lowly town. So there it is, folks. How to start a banished series, kill both of your starting people, and somehow manage to rescue it with two nomads that, believe it or not, literally spawn here. After the debacle that was the, uh, the original um, arrival of nomads... <laughs> All the way down here. Let me look how far. Why? Why? Why did he spawn them over here? Uh, when these when these two have literally spawned where they should have spawned. So yeah. So um, we we lost our first two people. Oh wait a minute. Did we lose the child as well? Oh my goodness. He literally killed everybody. Oh my. I've already decided what the title of this video is going to be. The best possible start to punish. <laughs> it has to be. I'm, I'm a little bit shocked and ashamed of myself at the same time. Yeah, but the main reason uh, they died is because we had no food. So the first thing I'm clearly doing is stocking up on the food. Because, yes, that makes sense. Um, we didn't even get around to making any tools. Thankfully, we have a man and a woman, so that, that's sort of useful in itself. But let, let's build up a little bit of food. I mean, he's just, he's just standing there. It's, I mean, it's sort of hiding behind a rock, but I mean, I don't know. I'm, I'm just sort of saying somebody should go and deal with that deer. My God, I sounded like Palpatine then, didn't I? Do it. <laughs> Did somebody hear what I said? All the deers are running. <laughs> oh my goodness. So I think it's time that we make some tools because we don't want a tool apocalypse on top of everything else. I mean, Angel's View it seems quite aptly named now when I think about it. Because <laughs> everybody dies. So yeah, we'll get some tools put in. And um, then we'll think about clothes. Because that's going to be one of the next thing. Uh, yeah, we got one hide coat left. Depends how well our hunter is doing. Not very well, which is a little bit disappointing. All the plants just disappeared. That means it's autumn, which means we're going to die soon. I mean, I'm trying to keep a positive outlook on things. Oh, here comes the snow. But we have um, some firewood, but some, that firewood is currently... Is it, oh, no, it's just logs. We're using logs, so that's good. Maybe uh, the other person, which is currently a hunter, which has not done anything for us. I'm just wondering if they should make some firewood. There we go. Perfect. Because we, we lost everyone to hunger initially. So the last thing we want to do is lose everybody uh, to the cold. That being said, I don't know how much this house uses per um, per year or per um, like winter per winter per season. There we go. Um, I'm not even sure how much food the average person eats. I don't know if education or anything like that um, plays any part. But obviously, I've never been sort of a uh, min maxer sort of player. I just kind of go with the flow and frustrate everybody because that's what I do. Okay, we have a, a truckload of uh, charcoal there, so. Let's get you making some... Oh, wait a minute. We made charcoal. Was it... Wasn't charcoal that we needed? Unless... <laughs> God. We needed a smelter. Why did nobody tell me we needed a smelter? Oh, gosh. Um, is there a small... Dinky little um, smelter here? What have we got? 
Okay, here we go. So, we have our iron kill. I don't know why I built this. We don't even need... Unless we can do this. I don't know. I'll, I'll put it like that because it does say charcoal. I don't know if charcoal can be... I, I don't know. We'll soon find out. But we have the, <laughs> you have the ability to make... Uh, iron now which will probably use charcoal so it may go it may come full circle there and um, what are we building here we're building a tailor as well perfect for some reason the builder has gone walkabout oh no oh no where are you oh you've built the bridge it's winter though i don't think it's a good idea to sort of come on oh my goodness she's gonna freeze to death Oh my god. Can you believe that? She was literally there. <laughs> she was literally standing there. Like <laughs> the the food. The food was there. The warmth was there. And they died. This oh my this is definitely without a shadow of a doubt the best start to banish ever. <laughs> Oh gosh, you guys are gonna absolutely crucify me in the comments. I, I can see it now. Oh, it's time. It's spring. And our builder is finished. So the first thing I'm gonna do is... Ah, charcoal. See? This building wasn't a mistake. He, he says. So straight away, um, we'll have you doing that because we're gonna need tools. Please, please be here. Oh my gosh. Where are they? Why does it torture me so? Where have you put them? Where? Gosh, where, why? Why does it do this to me? I don't understand. This is not my fault. Please be on crying out loud. Why? Okay. Do we have the bridge? No, because we paused the bridge, obviously. But wait a minute. If we make them both builders, possibly, just possibly, this may actually... You're right, okay. You're, what, you're a builder. Okay, so we have two builders. Fingers crossed. What? 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 Wait. What? Where are you going? The bridge is here. The, uh, did I put another? Really? I mean, I'm just gonna let you finish it anyway. I mean, uh, you you finished it now, so it, that's fine. We'll let you do it. Where are you going? Why are you stopping? Job melter. What? What? What sort of job is a? You should be a builder. I didn't make anybody a melter, and we have a tool apocalypse as well absolutely amazing oh wait a minute let's go back to the town that was that job so the builder switched roles i see i get it now that's fine um okay so we have um some iron i'm guessing hopefully we have some logs in there okay so no we do need to assign someone to that fair enough right builder melter of course do i have to make everybody builders is that how it's gonna be no, we're, we're, we're almost there. Oh my goodness. This is stressing me out unbelievably. We have a bridge. Cross it, please. Praise the Lord. Please make it home in time. Right, okay. Okay, so we're back up here. We, we need to unpause this house because we have an extra adult. And I don't think that they're all going to live in the same house. I don't think it works that way. Well, at least one of them is because they haven't got a house. Unless... Will they... Will they eat... Will they take food from here even? Oh my gosh. Oh, the stress. The stress is unbearable. Okay, hopefully we get this house uh, built as quickly as possible. Then we can deal with the tool apocalypse. This has been, this has been, this has been epic. There is no other word for it. Everybody else who uploads videos to YouTube would have scrapped it, would have started again. But no, here I am persevering just to show how adaptable I am. I mean... <laughs> This is not how I planned for it to go. And I, I guess that makes it more entertaining, maybe. I, I don't know. Um, I certainly know one thing for sure. The moment I finish recording this video, I'm going to go to the kitchen. I'm going to fill the kettle with water. And I'm going to make myself a nice cup of English tea. And it's a sunny day. Nice. So I may even go and sit in the garden and before, <laughs> before I edit the video and have to watch back at what I actually did today. That is, is just shameful. <laughs> but anyway, on that note, thank you for watching. But until next time, as always, take care.